Welcome to News in Brief from Marjayat Global Network. Grand Ayatollah Shuazi welcomes different people at his central office. A big number of scholars, Islamic teachers and students, university professors and students, and the public groups of people gathered at the central office of the Grand Islamic leader Ayatollah Shuazi in the holy city of Qom and meet his eminence on a daily basis. During these meetings, the guests give ear to the precious advices by Grand Ayatollah Shuazi and give reports of the latest religious and cultural activities in different parts of the world. Assembly of Islamic Missionaries and Lecturers at Grand Ayatollah Shuazi Central Office. With the approach of Ramadan Holy Month and following an old procedure, the Central Office of the Grand Islamic Leader Ayatollah Shuazi in Holy Qom welcomed a large number of Islamic missionaries and lecturers as well as scholars and Islamic students. The Islamic missionaries and lecturers listened to the important guidelines and instructions of the Grand Ayatollah Shuazi about performing missionary tasks in Ramadan month. Afghan women hold scientific session in Kabul. With the efforts of Lady Masum Islamic Seminary School and on the threshold of Ramadan month, there was a scientific conference under the theme of education in Islam held by the women in Afghanistan's capital, Kabul. This conference was aimed at preparing the opportunity of equal education for the women, resolving the social hurtless and eliminating the stress on women. Dr. Muhammad Asif Mohsini made a speech at this conference. The Islamic Seminary School of Lady Masuma in Kabul is supported by the Gwanda Ayatollah Shwazi. Charity works by Shuazi followers office. Following the orders of the Grand Ayatollah Shuazi and on the threshold of Ramadan month, the Shuazi followers office in Baghdad held charity works and distributed life necessities among the poor and the families of the Iraqi volunteer troops. This charity work covered hundreds of families.